Welcome to Every Frank Ever. Like and subscribe for more amazing facts. My name is Ian, and this is 50 Facts About Unicorns, written by Beth Morris. Fact number one. The first known image of a so-called unicorn was found in a cave in 15,000 BC. This drawing actually shows two horns, so people aren't too sure if the discovery is accurate or truthful. Fact number two. Titius is the first Greek historian to actually describe a unicorn. When speaking about the unicorn's horn, he said it was white at the bottom, black in the middle and red at the tip. So not quite like how they are portrayed to us today. Fact number three. It is not uncommon for a unicorn to have purple eyes. They can also have sky blue eyes as well. Fact number four. There is an underwater creature that is really similar to a unicorn. This animal is called a narwhal. The narwhal is a type of whale that lives in the waters around Canada. Fact number five. Unicorns can't fly, contrary to popular belief. To get a flying unicorn, you would need a pegasus and a unicorn to breed together. Fact number six. The unicorn is sometimes seen as a sign of divine truth. If you lie, the unicorn is said to pierce your heart with its horn. Fact number seven. Marco Polo saw rhinos on his travels, but thought they were unicorns. He actually thought the creatures were quite ugly. Fact number eight. Genghis Khan decided to call off an attack on India because a unicorn bowed to him. He saw it as a sign from his father that he was not happy about the event. Fact number nine. Unicorns don't actually need to eat as they absorb the sun's energy through their horns, although they do eat grass and hay. Fact number 10. Contrary to how they are portrayed, unicorns come in an array of colours. They can be classic white, black or a mix of warm colours. Legend says you can see red unicorns too. Fact number 11. In the UK, unicorns, including their horns, were used in many pharmaceutical practices. They did this up until the 1700s. It is unclear what ailment they were trying to treat though. Fact number 12. Unicorns are both male and female. According to reports, both kinds of sexual organs are inside a unicorn. Fact number 13. Did you know that the Old Testament from 1611, the King James Version, had at least nine references to unicorns in it? It is largely thought that this might have been a mini translation error, and the creature they were trying to discuss was the realm, which is an ox. Fact number 14. Apparently, touching a pure white unicorn will bring you internal happiness. In some cultures, it can also bring good luck. Fact number 15. In the 15th and 16th centuries, there were coins known as unicorns and the half unicorn. These coins were used in Scotland. Fact number 16. It wasn't uncommon to see a unicorn on the coat of arms of royalty in the 1400s. Scotland is a well-known example. The unicorns tend to look a bit like horses with goat hoofs, parts of lions with horns. Fact number 17. It was Cosmas Indodoplestes from Alexandria who suggested that all unicorn strength was in its horn. He documented this in the 6th century. Fact number 18. Contrary to popular belief, unicorns are not found in Greek mythology. However, some authors from ancient Greek have written documents about unicorns. Fact number 19. Purchasing a unicorn's horn is going to set you back a fair few dollars. It was reported that the price of a unicorn's horn was always 10 times the horn's weight in gold. It was noted in 1560 that German merchants actually sold unicorn horns for 90,000 scudi. Fact number 20. In the Middle Ages, unicorn was seen as a symbol of grace. Today we see unicorns as a symbol of fantasy worlds. Fact number 21. To hunt unicorns, you must obtain a license. You can get this from Lake Superior State University, Michigan. Once you get the license, you can hunt for life and hunt anywhere. To be clear, this only applies to unicorns, and best of all, it's free. Fact number 22. According to Jewish mythology about unicorns, a unicorn has enough power to bring down a full-sized elephant. A full-sized Asian elephant can weigh up to 11,000 pounds. Fact number 23. When two groups of unicorn families meet, they don't fight each other for territory. Instead, they live happily among each other for months on end until one family moves on. Every day they go about their tasks amicably. Fact number 24. Powdered unicorn horn was being sold in the UK until 1741. It wasn't actually used to treat illnesses, instead the powder was often placed into display cabinets to show off to customers and friends. Fact number 25. There is a band called the Unicorns who play rock music. This band formed in Canada in the year 2000. Fact number 26. Unicorn Dash is one of the biggest selling unicorn driven games you can download today. The aim of the game is to make sure the unicorn gets home. Fact number 27. Lake Superior State University, Michigan is the most popular place to hunt unicorns. The university advises the following, 
When hunting unicorns, you are advised to take plenty of supplies and something to hunt with. Wise words indeed. Fact number 28. The Last Unicorn is a popular 1968 fantasy novel written by Peter Beagle. To this day, the novel is still popular in the fantasy book scene. Fact number 29. Due to unicorn legends, the narwhal has come under threat on countless occasions. Because people often thought unicorn horns treated ailments, they would often take the narwhal's tooth, believing it to be the same creature as the unicorn. Fact number 30. Although kids' playrooms are adorned with rainbows and unicorns to bring about feelings of happiness, the actual saying rainbows and unicorns means the opposite. The saying is actually used to describe the situation that has turned sour rather than happiness. Fact number 31. The blending of unicorns and rainbows took off in the 2000s. This occurred because of a lot of TV shows and toys like My Little Pony. Fact number 32. A black unicorn is not the evil opposite of the classic white unicorn. A black unicorn is associated with strength and the idea of being able to get over and to move beyond one's problems. Fact number 33. Unicorns are said to be drawn towards innocence and purity. Legend says if a virgin sits naked below a tree, a unicorn will reveal itself. Fact number 34. The classical legend of having a virgin sit under a tree and a unicorn showing up is apparently the easiest way to capture and kill a unicorn. The virgin and the unicorn are both at peace with each other, so a hunter can strike easily. Fact number 35. A unicorn's horn is actually called its alcorn. The alcorn is said to hold great medicinal and magical healing powers. Fact number 36. Famous people like to associate themselves with great mythological creatures. Bennett Marthus is no different. He calls himself the Black Unicorn. Marthus played for Chicago Bears in his football days. He abducted the nickname because black unicorns are really rare but talented. He saw himself as being super rare and talented too. Fact number 37. Contrary to the solitary animals we see in pictures, unicorns like to live in groups of four and five. You tend to see little unicorn couples and their kids. Fact number 38. European and Asian myths often discuss unicorns. A famous tapestry, The Hunt for the Unicorns, is just one example. There are also many more tapestries and engravings. Fact number 39. Chinese mythology also has its own version of the unicorn called the Quillen. The creatures are said to have pointy horns like a unicorn, but many reports say they are more likely a hybrid animal. Fact number 40. Unicorn horn treatment was reserved for the richest people in the land. Nicholas Culpepper, an English botanist, once suggested that to make horn powder, used to heal ailment, you would need ivory, pearl, horn, as well as grains, all of which would have been super expensive to get hold of a century ago. Fact number 41. Lewis Carroll's Through the Looking Glass included a unicorn character. The unicorn takes part in a little discussion between the characters about believing in unicorns. Fact number 42. Once you've captured your unicorn, be sure to stand back and arm yourself. Unicorns are said to become quite vicious when they feel trapped. It is nearly impossible to tame a unicorn. Fact number 43. Another version of the unicorn in Chinese mythology is the bow horse. The bow horse is said to be a chimera horse with an ox tail, white in colour, with a signature horn. Fact number 44. Unicorns tend to live deep in the forest. This is when they are likely to eat hay and grass, as there is little sunlight to get energy from. Fact number 45. Unicorn families are run by the eldest unicorn. This unicorn is usually hundreds of years old. Fact number 46. Although we associate the word unicorn with fantasy, mystery, wisdom, purity and so on, the literal meaning of the word in Latin is single horn. The Latin word for unicorns, uni, means single and corner means horn. Fact number 47. The unicorn has long been associated with femininity. Why? Because there is an idea of the unicorn bringing purity, energy and nurturing to the world, much like a mother nurtures her baby. Fact number 48. Labradors are said to upset unicorns. Nobody really knows why, but unicorns are said to be cool with the common people. Fact number 49. There was a throne in Denmark made completely of unicorn horn. Given that unicorns are incredibly hard to find, capture, and they get upset when you capture them, this was quite an accomplishment. Fact number 50. Queen Elizabeth I was given a unicorn horn by Martin Frobisher, an explorer. The horn, according to Frobisher, was washed upon the shore in northern Canada, which just so happens to be the area where you might find narwhals. And that was 50 facts about unicorns. Thank you for watching, and remember to like and subscribe for more amazing facts. And if you still haven't had your fact fix, try watching some of these videos. And if you have any suggestions for topics you'd like us to cover, please leave a comment down below.